What's up, gang? It is Cowboy Rocksteady. Uh, today, I have something very exciting. Um, we're going to do a little shift on this channel. Um, I am pretty focused on, well, I'm focused on a couple of TCGs and CCGs uh, this time around, but I am very focused on one in particular, and that one is... You might want to be paying attention to that logo. Uh, this is the Patreon rewards um, for a game that is pre-Kickstarter. Before Kickstarter, guys. So in this age of so many games exploding on Kickstarter, I think it is important to be early. To be early to test out the game, see if you're vibing with the art, seeing if you're vibing with the creator, and hopefully watching it grow from there. So when everybody's freaking out over Kickstarters and dumping money, be looking out for games that are pre-Kickstarter. And there are two uh, specifically right now, which are Maelstrom, which we're going to get into, and Sorcery Contested Realm. But for me and my focus, I am very big into... Devin Miners, Miner Games, LLC, Maelstrom, CCG. Uh, this is a game that, quite honestly, the art, uh, Nicole S., a.k.a. Wizard of Canto, uh, on Discord. Y'all go uh, check out the Discord uh, there for Maelstrom, but um, really exciting stuff. The art really is, is really different from anything that I've seen uh, in the CCG world, very sort of abstract, colorful, um, you know, crystallized, very interesting. Um, there is a tier uh, of the Patreon called, called the Gods of Maelstrom, which I am one of 10. I am one of 10 members uh, in the entire community. And uh, with that, we're going to get some extra bonuses and a one of 10 printed Gods of Maelstrom card that we have been uh, in negotiations and talks with Devin and Nicole on how that card's going to look. So uh, we're very excited to reveal that on this channel. But be looking out for Maelstrom, guys. This was uh, the remnants of Final Redemption, uh, a TCG uh, from a couple of months ago. Um, that has shifted to Maelstrom. Um, I'm sure y'all can do some research and come to your own conclusions, but I have spoken with Devin uh, personally through Discord and, and messaging and things like that. Fantastic, generous, gracious dude that uh, has invested a lot into this game. So without further ado, we're going to open this. I have ordered one of everything that they've offered um, and this says uh, Patreon reward, but I don't know if there's some other things bundled in here. Um, so we're going to open it up because this is the way. <laughs> okay, gang, let's kind of dive into what we have here. So this says the Patreon reward, which, uh, again, you know, I am one of 10 of the gods of Maelstrom on the Discord and Patreon. So um, I have certainly ordered a number of things as well. Um, and so uh, we are going, yeah, it looks like this is a lot of bundled together stuff that I have ordered and also uh, my rewards for backing on Patreon. Uh, included in this tier are some wink wink, not safe for work cards. These are beautiful kind of artwork uh, of well endowed uh, women and other uh, systems. So uh, super excited about that. Um, so I'm going to make a deal with you guys. If you will like and subscribe and send me a message via YouTube, I will show you a photo of the not safe for work card. And 
that was another thing that really sort of drew me to um, this CCG is that again, that is just something really different. And, and I appreciate that. I honestly do. I, I think that it's okay to explore um, these types of, of things and issues uh, in today's society. Um, so uh, very excited. I love the use of colors uh, in this, but uh, if you would like to like, subscribe, and send me a message, I will go ahead and show you what the Not Safe for Work Special Edition non-playable card looks like. Very waifu style, um, honestly very tasteful, very cool. So if you'd like to check that out, uh, please hit me up. This was a request uh, that I had made to Devin to sign one of the sample packs for me. And he has done that there with a yeehaw. <laughs> uh, it's, it's very faint. It's in pink. But uh, I love that. It's got the date there. It's got Devin Miner's signature and threw in a yeehaw there. So, man, Devin, thank you so much if you're watching this. Uh, we have the Coming Soon Kickstarter label there. So, again, guys, this is pre-Kickstarter. This is pre-Kickstarter. So I'm going to hold on to this. I'm going to cherish this. I love this pink. Um, this is one of the dragons that is a chase card in the set. There's also a distortion crystal. But man, these just look so good uh, in person. Honestly, guys, um, I was very fortunate to order five of these. These sold out in a matter of minutes. Um, so we're going to open some of these on the channel. Not a lot of these have been opened on YouTube. And then we're going to get into uh, what might be in here. Uh, these are the Exhaust and Engorge um, alternate art promos that, again, I had Devin sign in pink. So you can barely see that. But this was a card that was sort of near and dear uh, to him and sort of what he has gone through to get this game um, off of the ground. And I really appreciate that. Um, so if you see here, we have the sample stamp there and then uh, the sample stamp there and then alternate art a uh, alternate art stamp there. Both are signed in pink by Devin Miner, the owner and creator of Miner Games and also Maelstrom. And again, guys, what do you think about that art? Super unique, super different. Um, almost, you know, honestly, very digital, but I, I that sort of drew me to it. Um, so these were the two cards that I had requested for him to sign, um, and then this pack. So uh, very excited about that. We're going to hold on to these for a very, very long time. Um, let's see if we want to add some light. There we go. I think we needed to up the light there uh, for these pink signatures so you can kind of see that better and love that pink uh, is one of my favorite colors so um, I think maybe that's one of the reasons that I was drawn to uh, this game as well these are the Zaki Arcane Agent promo sets um, I did order um, some of the other uh, promo sets that um, I would assume are also coming my way. Um, but let's go ahead and check out um, some of these as well. So let's dive in. Yeah. So these are the Zaki Arcane Agent uh, Beast 
abomination, demonic, mechanical, and undead. And these are samples. So full holographic. The colors are just super cool. They have uh, the promo there. Um, 05, 06, 07, 08, and 09. So um, super cool. Love the foiling. Love the little kind of uh, beast art. Um, very cool. Very cool. Love the back with that sort of splatter paint. Um, and again, these have the sample stamp there. Uh, almost all of the card frame has this sort of like dragon bat wing um, sort of that ties in um, the artwork of the card. But I love that little mechanical dude. Isn't that cool? And then the undead Zaki. So super cool, super neat. Um, I really like that foiling. Really like how those look. So we're gonna fan those out here. We've got our signed Exhaustin and Gorge promo set along with the pack art. And then this is an additional set of Zaki Arcane Agent, which is super cool for them to include. What I'm very, very excited about are these sample packs. Um, these could contain some serious, serious spice. So what we're gonna do is, without further ado, we're gonna get into these. Um, I wonder if I can preserve, yes I can. I'm always big on preserving pack art. Um, this is where my OCD sort of kicks in, but I'm excited about the gameplay um, of this game too, guy. I mean, this is, again, super early in the process. Um, I know that Devin's been working on this game for quite some time, but, um, you know, once we get a little further along in the process, the game state and game board setup um, also is quite unique, um, and it's a little more kind of randomized, um, sort of fun than um, I anticipated. So once we get there, we will do a deep dive in, but uh, like I said, you know, we're definitely going to have a focus on the Maelstrom TCG, so if you're into that sort of thing, please like and subscribe and stay tuned because Devin is a great guy and we are going to be covering the game. So there is a full art foil sample Forgotten Forest. Very cool. Ridge of the Fallen, another location. So it seems to be that these maybe are all locations. Troublesome Terrain, Nanotech Shores, and there is a Fiend Night Creeper, illustration by Nocturne. So again, really sort of abstract, dreamlike, purple and pink, very interesting. Very interesting art. Uh, again, really drew me to the game. Um, really sort of turned my head. And um, again, you know, kind of the, some of the different things that they're doing that um, you potentially don't see in, uh, in the abundance of CCGs that are coming out right now. Um, one being this style of art. The second being such a great supportive community. Um, again, Devin, I, I feel actually cares for his Patreons, um, you know, is, is active, uh, in the discord. I'm going to go ahead and open these with the little scissors because that's typically a little easier if you can actually open it. Let's get in there. All right. Put these aside, and let's see what we get. 
And again, such a cool card back. That sort of neon, uh, ooh. So there's a Fang Maelstrom Phoenix. Um, the rarities are here in these crystals. Um, these were not super rare, um, but this um, is a, a more rare type. There is rarer than that sort of multicolored pink crystal, but uh, that is a good hit. There's Berserk Titan, also a good hit. Mechanical Monster, very cool. Again, very abstract. Mecha Magician, again, a mechanical beast. Kind of cool, kind of Netrunner style. Risen Scholar. Maybe my least art, favorite artwork in the game, but very cool nonetheless. And Teenage Mauler. He is a beast monster. So, very cool. That Fang uh, is a big hit. Uh, we're going to keep this pack um, unopened. And we're going to open one more right here on our channel. Let's see if old Cowboy Rocksteady can pull a piece of the Distortion Crystal or something super cool. Let's see if we can pull just a crazy chase card. Again, guys, Kickstarter coming soon. These are pre-Kickstarter, very early sample cards um, in an environment that there are just so many Kickstarters. It's really exciting to be a uh, in the Gods of Maelstrom um, tier and also to be opening these. So again, looks like another location pack and a volley ablaze. Very cool. And I think we just have to open another. We're just gonna have to do it. I love keeping things sealed as you guys know, but that's why I got Devin to sign that pack um, because that one is staying sealed. And we're going to get into this pack. It's already opened. There's no going back. And let's see if we can pull something spicy. Which would be quite exciting. So, let's see. Golly. I'm having trouble with these packs. But we're close. There we go. We've got our sample cards. Ooh. So Intense Blast. 007. That's super cool. Sinister Grave Warden. He is an undead fellow. Alloy Assassin, very cool. I'm really gravitating towards these mechanical cards, um, so I'm really interested to see kind of uh, how that gameplay um, ends up. And an Ancestral Blessing. So, very cool, guys. This is our first Maelstrom opening here on the channel. Um, we have our sample pack signed by Devin. We have our Exhaust and Engorge. We have our Zaki Arcane Agent uh, promo sets, which are very cool. And very excited for our next opening. Um, and in the meantime, guys, open packs. Um, get involved in your local gaming scene because, after all, this is the way. Peace.